Hi everyone, Bok here with another update of the Convectio stream minigame. Uh, this one is for the version 29. The main thing about this one is reworking your menus to enable a local area network multiplayer. So you can see here I have login button for testers as I had before. I have this uh, Convectio like info pages uh, with uh, frequently asked questions, also link to the Twitch stream and uh, the main thing in this version is this LAN page which I'll show in a second also I have quit button so this is what was missing before I'll use a gamepad controller so as you see as soon as I start using it it shows uh, hints for shortcuts and if I choose LAN page here uh, you can see I can search the LAN and I can also host server so you can experiment with this one. When you download it, it will be available. So if I go play here, from the start, you can see that I start with in this uh, hovering spectator mode. And I can switch in this mode, I can switch between these sprouting pods. At the moment, it is hard coded so that I can switch between two out of three pods. In the future, this will tie into the backstory and the gameplay. For now, it's just hard coded like that and i can all at any point i can uh, spawn my droid on on the pod uh, by using mouse i just click the left mouse button or with uh, game controller i click a or on playstation controller x button so i spawn at this point uh, i can also if i'm standing at the pod and i engage terminal connection to the pod then it recycles the droid and i'm back in this uh, mode where i can teleport the next update is when i spawn this uh, kite as before i can spawn a kite bag plastic bag or rock here if i spawn a kite i can uh, I can, as before, I can tie a rope to it, but in this version, the physics be uh, of the kite behaves uh, much better, and I can actually do this. And also, if I want, I can I can tie this with an, uh, with this, my left hand, for example. I can pull this, and I can tie this uh, kite to this rock. And with double click, you disconnect the rope and yeah i can do this now so if i spawn on the upper pad here i have option to uh, spawn also kite a plastic bag and the third option is a uh, hang glider here so i can spawn uh, free flying ha hang gliders here in this version still uh, not uh, flyable you can attach rope and play with it in that way and down there you can see at the cave entrance you have this third pod which is not accessible in that spectator mode but you can walk to it and here you have the option to spawn also tracks this T placeholder you can also sp spawn all the other things but the trike is uh, the main thing here and if you choose this S point, you select it by pressing X, then you enter the glider. This was also available in previous versions. What's new in this one is that prop now has sounds. So you can hear the, the engine sound or rather just the prop sound. And the prop physics is also much improved so it now behaves much more realistic you can yeah if you if you uh, climb high and dive then it also s spins up and things like that so yeah it's much better now you can see here also i have mm, i implemented many um, I added many improvements of, uh, for the landscape. Uh, I have the landscape extended to the whole island surface. So I uh, removed uh, 
uh, most of this uh, gray platform thing and I am now just uh, sketching what the the landscape will look like so yeah you can expect a lot of uh, updates there also and yeah uh, there are a lot of uh, m uh, smaller improvements like uh, quality of life for for testers and also for uh, for just uh, playing Yeah, you can download this one uh, on itch.io, it's free, you can play with it, you can test it, uh, you can also catch regular streams on Twitch on Sundays and Wednesdays. Go to the channel, if you open the menu and go uh, to this info, you can uh, get the information about that. And yeah, you can follow to get notifications. Uh, you can join Discord server. Uh, you'll, uh, you can find link for Discord uh, on YouTube and also on Twitch and uh, also on itch.io uh, on the download page for the game. And you can share your ideas and suggestions if you want. And you can also support on Patreon or buy me a coffee. So yeah, uh, that's it for this update. Uh, thank you and happy testing. Bye.